Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Delhi Tarot and these are your money career finance focus reading for the sun moon and the rising sign of Aries. Aries please keep in mind that this is your general money career reading. It's a group general reading. So yes, it is always different from your personal private reading because personal private reading is done as per your date of birth, your time and it has your karmic energy, your journey, your aura, your soul messages. So definitely it's a different and everybody get a different and a unique reading. And if you really like what I do on the channel, please do like subscribe the channel and for any personal private reading or a healing process to enhance your professional or personal life. All my details are mentioned in the description box below. I appreciate you sending an email or a WhatsApp message, but no direct calls, please. I really appreciate your understanding. Now I'm going to do your Oracle card reading and then I'm going to do your tarot card reading for the month of February. And this time I'm going to start the March reading on time so that I completely come on track. And I will also do your weekly reading for the month of February. But let me complete the money career reading. Aries, you have time to let go. You have something, life, strains. And then you have, there is always enough. And this is your, oh my goodness, I didn't realize you have two extra animal cards. Because today I'm getting a lot of your extra messages, Aries. Watch and wait. And then you have the give with gratitude and grace. Now with so many animal spirit messages, one thing is absolutely clear that there is a delay happening with you, Aries. Things are not clear to you professionally or things are not taking the pace as per your expectations and choice. However, the card of wait and watch says that, you know, it's time for you to still uh, you know have patience because you know the divine wants to give you something extraordinary something which is not routine and that is taking little time in nurturing something stable something long lasting and the divine is in no hurry to give you anything you wish or desire which is temporary which is not stable which is not going to last for long or which is not going to, uh, you know, suit you money wise, finances wise or professionally. Now, I do see that this particular year you will see a shift post post August. I'm sensing from your group reading, but that can be different for people in personal readings. So, yes, there is a modulation coming. There is a transformation coming. So, don't be in hurry in grabbing any opportunity which is coming your way like haywire and you are fed up with what you are doing currently and you quickly change the pace. Please know that is going to be a downfall. That is going to be a shutdown kind of situation. That is not going to suit you. So, just wait and watch. Wait for something stable and it says keep giving gratitude and grace for whatever you already have in your high hand which is continued from past so many months or years time. No rush, no hurry, no impulsiveness, no aggression is needed roughly from February to April. Just see what is getting revealed post your birthday Aries. I am sensing that from this current birthday in the month of April... Since your time period will change, your year will change and then the, you know, slow and steadily, you will have a very robust kind of transformation which is going to help you. Till that time, please know that there is always enough for you and your family to feel safe, to feel secure, to feel stable. Now from your reading, I do not see that you will have any any crisis of money, any crisis of finances. I understand that, you know, from your reading that you might need to use your money, use your saving, use your incoming in a wise manner, in a planned manner or in a strategized manner. But yes, I will not suggest you to spend on luxury, much on luxury travel or, or a heavy investment during this time. Till the time you get the next move or a next career choice as per your own wish and desire. And something very important, the critical, the, the not so pleasant time, the emotional painful time, the not so rewarding time. 
just let it go because that is not actually going to solve your purpose either ways and yes sometime it do feels life stings because this thing i do feel it's a it's a sting of delay it's a much delay which has happened to you but you know uh, i was uh, i was introspecting when i was doing your reading the angels were saying that there is also possibility that you have tried some opportunities in the past and recently you have got to know oh that was closed or the company was not doing well it's good i did not shift it for that opportunity i did not went for that op interview i did not said yes to that opportunity i did not compromise i did not you know adjusted or came down just to accept the situation or the offer yes it was very much into your favor so if you have not opted chosen or closed any offer in the recent past you have done it right because that would have been temporary and that would have given you a major financial emotional mental loss as well now let us see what messages do we have in your moonology it says be bold and make the first move conclusions are within reach and it's time to breathe out it's time for you to give space to yourself it's time for you to mentally emotionally heal yourself whatever your wish and desire it will come true conclusions are definitely within reach try to take all the necessary move action planning and strategies but then change wisely choose wisely the transformation has to be a very very self introspected conscious call something which is not taken in a very abrupt ad hoc or an impulsive manner take time in you know and when i say take time to breathe out if you have gone through extreme anxiety and stress you need to take a back seat from the situation make yourself aloof make yourself distant and see how things are reviving beautifully for you now let us see what goddess oracle message do we have for you you have a card of be strong now this is the message we are getting it in a repeated form both the card says you need to be bold you need to be strong you are stronger than you think you are aries and your strength is going to ensure a very very happy outcome oh my god you do have a card of prosperity the universe is pouring its abundance out to you aries be open to receive and trust me your april season your birthday season is suddenly going to bring rainbow materialistic blessing i do feel that your money career professional uh, you know there is there are huge massive changes one opportunity and a complete shift and i really claim that this particular year is going to be extraordinary because this is the year of saturn and you're definitely going to receive the justice the fairness and i was about to tell you and i'm so happy that the angels have given this car of confirmation aries because when i was talking about saturn i was talking about saturn is lord of justice lord of karma you will be paid well the justice the fairness the deservingness which you feel i deserve this money i deserve this qualification i deserve this position i deserve this name fame respect and recognition and status into my profession like that is definitely going to come to you it says the situation will be handled in a fair and just manner for sure now let us see what messages do we have in the first part of the february which is already going on the first two weeks and then i'm also going to see the second part of the month which is the last two weeks of february now in the first two first parts you have five of pentacle still mourning over a lost opportunity a lost job lost money there are chances and then you have queen of pentacle no matter how hard is the situation your money finances will come into control with your intellectual energy with your power with your wisdom of handling money handling finances you will be able to handle everything nicely and then you have the hangman a situation you are i can definitely see you are trying to adjust completely with a happy smile but i do agree do understand do sense from your reading that this is not really you want you are doing you want to do something extraordinary as per your capability 
as per your capacity, as per your caliber, and you know that you deserve a lot more professionally, not just status, but money status, name status, recognition status, fame status, and you're not there right at the moment. So you are definitely compromising with the situation. Trust me, it is going to be in your favor because this is your testing time. You're balancing your karma and I have great hopes post your birthday season. In the second part of February, you do have 10 of Pentacle. Now, Aries, this is absolutely 100% not just related to you. I do feel this is going to bring a big happy news which is related to money, career, finances, not just to you. But it can be a news within a family, maybe your spouse, your children, your siblings. But some money, career, finance, professional good news which is related to enhancement of money is going to come and fall into your kitty. But then this could be true for you also. Maybe you receive some expected, unexpected money, a jackpot and sister's money, a property falling into your favor. Because when you have a card of fairness, if you're going through a very legal case, this oracle card and this tarot card combination is a, is a foolproof uh, you know, message that if you're going through a legal property case or legal money financial case, you have filed, it is going to come into your favor for sure. It's a very strong oracle and tarot card combination for the confirmation. You have knight of cups. Yes, a news of celebration. The cup is a sign of celebration. The cup is a sign of win and victory and this is going to come to you true and then you have 10 of wands. So you do have 10 and 10. It says a cycle is getting completed, cycle of burden, over responsibility, not so happy situation. But yes, with 10 on 10, look at your card, the burden, the over responsibility get over but you are rewarded. You are applauded and you are moving away with materialistic win, triumph and victory, materialistic gain, the money falling into your favor right here. Now let us see what angel messages do we have from your reading today. And it says, now that you have asked the angel for help, be open to receiving divine guidance and assistance. You deserve heaven's help for sure. And your other card of the reading is keep changing ahead. Keep charging ahead and don't take no for an answer. Expect miraculous solutions to appear truly into your life. And this is what I can sense from the card of prosperity. I can sense this from fairness. And then you have 10 of pentacles. It's a clear, clear indication that the miraculous blessings which is going to help you in witnessing the hard-earned money coming to your bank account, the money which you can see, the finances which you can see soaring up, growing up, it is going to happen for sure. You never know miracles when it happens, but it is going to be true for you for sure. Now let us see your last card of the reading, the Angel of Abundance. In the shuffle is needed again let us see what messages do we have donation teething and charitable work whatever you are earning start giving just one percent of that back to society to needy to poor and see how the money circulation is happening with you it says give joyfully to the organization and people who spiritually support and inspire you and know that your generosity will be returned to you many folds in miraculous way what you give you will receive the time supplies money or other resources you donate will ensure that your positive energy is going to get multiplied. It's a very beautiful reading. Maybe with this justice, with your recent past karma of donation or your previous past life donation act, kindness, karma can come back to you. And you know, when you get sudden money in your life, unexpected money, a jackpot or something coming into your favor in a very tough situation, please know that is not just your current, but it is your definitely your past life or your, you know, your recent current past life or maybe your last life. It is something which you give 
comes to you tenfold and then you see the miracles and blessings coming into your favor Aries I really enjoyed doing your reading it's a very very clear indicative money career finance reading do let me know how you resonated with it I will see you next time very soon be blessed